Hello, I've, I've noticed that a lot of people are having trouble with converting HDMI to VGA with certain monitors and adapters. Um, it is possible. Um, I've just got a $4 little um, converter from Hong Kong, which is working just nicely. But um, So it's not a hardware issue, but a software. Well, not so much software, but you just have to edit the config file. Um, so we'll show you how to do that today. So if you just go to um, the memory card that you've already flashed the operating system on, just open that up, you'll see a file called config.txt. So we'll just open that up. Okay, so I've already edited mine, um, but you can see all of these basic comments. Um, one you're going to have to look down to is uncomment to force the specific HDMI mode. Um, so just uncomment that, so basically um, when you got it to begin with, you've got Oh, that there, so that basically comments it out. So just take off both of those. Um, anything else we need to take off? No, I've overclocked mine. You can, that's optional. Um, basically, you wanted to say, I'll keep disabled overscan there, so leave that there. Um, if it goes off screen, just um, uncomment those and just edit those as you will. It just, yeah, positive numbers it goes off screen negative if there's too much border, so that's the. Um, black border around the screen. Um, so we'll save that and we'll just close that, close that and then you're good to just remove that. I don't ever safely reject because I'm just badass. Um, so now when you connect your um, memory card to the Raspberry Pi it should connect to the monitor. So if you've got any questions just leave a message in the comments below and I shall get on to answering that. Alright then, thank you. Yeah, I hope this has helped.